All right, so you podcasters and live streamers out there, I have this product that works perfectly for your audio interface. It looks amazing and it has some amazing features. So let me tell you about it. Mr. Black. By the way, welcome to the channel. My name is Danny Black. I love to share with you cool gear that comes my way. And if you're new here, don't be a stranger. I'll put links to everything down in the description, plus a surprise link. And here it is, the Maono Caster. And as you can see, it has a lot of really cool buttons and lights. And well, let's just go ahead and break this down. And starting with the ports on the back, you have the power button and a mute button. You also have a charging port because this thing will actually give you eight hours of use with the internal battery. There's a USB-C port to connect it to your computer for an interface. And it's just plug and play as soon as you plug it in, it recognizes it as a device. You have two live outputs and a speaker output. There's an auxiliary input and an eighth inch secondary mic input and a quarter inch instrument input if you wanna play guitar or keyboard or things that plug in like that. Next to that, you also get a XLR as well as a quarter inch input for bigger microphones. And also you can adjust it for a condenser or a dynamic setting. And if you have the Shure SM7B like you're listening to right now, well, you know that you could actually save a lot of money because you don't need that cloud lifter. You can just get something like this and it gives you a lot more features. Okay, and just a side note, I just finished recording the video and editing it. And well, their PD200X microphone came in. And you really can't tell a huge difference between my $400 microphone and this $80 microphone, especially if you want to use their denoise. And now you have better noise cancelization. You can also add some like reverb to it nice and easily. So with this interface, that helps out a lot. But also this microphone includes USB output as well as XLR output. It has direct headphones out and also volume control and headphone control. They have a mute button, anti-shock mount and anti-pop filter and this really cool programmable RGB light. Honestly, this is a really, really good setup, but let's just go ahead and get back to the video. Looking at the board, you have down here the 48 volt phantom power. There is a button to turn on Bluetooth and you can connect it to external recording devices. You have mics one and two volume faders and a big dial for the auxiliary levels. You have your meters right here and also dials up on the top for EQ, instrument gain and volume and your headphone monitor. And you have a dial for your output volume. There's a sound pad on here with 11 pre-programmable sound effects. So if you have something that you say all the time in your podcast, you can actually pre-record that just by holding down the button and then uh, you can record it and then you just press it and it plays it back. So right now we're just gonna hold this thing down. Now it's gonna be recording and we're gonna be, uh, yeah, what's up everybody? And then we will play it back. It's gonna be recording and we're gonna be, uh, yeah, what's up everybody? And then you can also record external sound effects the same way with like, inputting the auxiliary sounds and then recording it onto the board like that. On the lower right side, there is a pad volume and pitch if you want to change your pitch like, like I'm doing right now. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. So you can get really low and you can get really high. <laughs> There's also a reverb knob right here to adjust the level and amount of reverb you want when you do turn on your reverb presets. So check this out. So this is uh, this is the karaoke reverb and you can, yeah, you can adjust the volume of the reverb like that. Uh, this is church, church reverb. They actually sound really good. Check one, hey, 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 hey. Oh, like this is a big valley. Hello, hello. Yeah, they're really good. Next to that, you have a side chain button. And what that does is it's like ducking. So if you have some music playing and then you talk on top of it, it will automatically lower that volume. Next to that, you have a music only button. And what that actually does is if you have some music playing, you can actually press that and it will get rid of the vocals and just keep it music, which is great if you wanna sing along to some songs, maybe do a little bit of karaoke like that, you can actually press that button and it will eliminate the voices. There is a dry and wet button here if you do or don't want to monitor those direct effects. You also have a loop back button and a denoise button. And that denoise button is really handy because if there's some noise in your room, if there's a fan going, you can press that, check this out. So this is low noise cancellation and it gets rid of any of that. Like there's maybe a little bit of st like static or something, not static, but like some noise there. And this is noise cancellation high. So, I mean, like, I have to really talk into it loud to keep it from going off. But it does work really well. If there's a lot of noise, this is what you want. 
And that's basically the gist of the board right there. It does come with a long USB-C to USB-A cable for charging or plugging in. And it comes with two 3.5 millimeter auxiliary cables so you can plug it into your smartphone. There's also a nice manual to show you how all of this works and you can also get it with their boom arm. So this is a nice little boom arm that you can put a microphone onto and you can clamp it onto your desk, which helps out a lot when you're doing podcasts and live streams. So it looks cool and as you can hear, it sounds awesome. I mean, we can have a lot of fun with it and uh, add some of that reverb. Yeah, I mean, like, there's just a lot of features on here that you can play around with. And you can also check out their website because they do have some more microphones there. And make sure you click the link in the description for the most current price because they do have some great deals for bundles of all of this put together. Especially if you're just starting your podcasting or you just want to take your podcasting to the next level. But on this channel, I'm not trying to get you to spend your money. I just want to share with you what's out there. And if you're in the market for it, well, you know what this one looks like, what it does, what it sounds like, and where to get it. And you can decide for yourselves. Other than that, thank you so much for watching. I have a lot of really, really fun things happening on this channel. So make sure you stay tuned and I'll see you next time. Wait, hold on, let me put the reverb up for this one. Bye. Mr. Black. Can we call you Uncle Blackie? No.